Yo, what's up? This is Just Doom, and welcome to Persona 5 The Let's Play. In the last episode, Kamoshida confessed to his sins, and as of now, he's gonna be turning himself in. And we don't have to worry about ever getting, well, not ever, but for now, we don't have to worry about getting expelled because it's done with. And now, well, we're gonna celebrate our success, but not at this moment because, well, it's too late for that. Instead, we're gonna celebrate on the last day of the Golden Week, which is, uh, Thursday, which is Children's Day slash, oh wait, no, 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 that's not a holiday, that's what we're supposed to do, celebrate the victory. So, starting tomorrow, we have three days off because of Golden Week and stuff. Anyways, right now, I'm gonna go take a bath because, oh, wait, who are you? I don't think I've seen you before. Oh, you just got out of the bath. That wasn't a hot spring. I think that was just a bath. That's not a hot spring, sir. Oh. Gosh, oh my God, I am so broke. This is the most, this, I, 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 I'm gonna have to sell off some stuff actually. But I had to take a bath today. It's Monday. The best days to take ba ba ugh. the best day to take baths are on Mondays. Hmm. I can't give up three points towards charm. Right. If I was playing on safety mode, money wouldn't even be an issue because you get so much off of like mini bosses. But the problem is that I have too much pride to play on safety mode or safe mode, so I never do it. I'll never do it. I can't. Okay. Uh. How do you know I don't have plans? I guess he is our guardian, so. Hopefully this won't take all day. <sighs> you are my guardian. Wow, this made the news? Wow. Yep, it's my school. <sighs> A scumbag indeed. <sighs> so this girl's completely unaware. Hey. Seems like it. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna be an ass. Jeez. Hey, I had nothing to do with it. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Yes, sir. <sighs> yes, sir. Yup, and it took all freaking day. Looks like we'll have to do that tomorrow. I didn't I don't recall hearing it. Yeah, it's probably for the best. Especially after the whole suicide incident. Yep. Yes, we're selling it tomorrow. That's the only day we can sell it. <sighs> yes, I will. Don't worry. He's not getting my other day off of stuff. Make sure to do the dishes. Um... Uh, 
can't, 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 can I do them when I get back? Just do it. Uh, Don't get caught. I'm either. not. Look, I just have stuff to do. The Welcome. You. Am I interrupting oh, something? Oh, well, technically we haven't even met yet, so. Not at all. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh, is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? <laughs> I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Oh, damn. You gonna take that? Th that's exactly the <laughs> case. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? Huh? Shouldn't you know? I mean, uh, I mean, uh, Shujin Academy. Oh, someone I know goes there as well. Oh, do you know? I've heard that things are rough right now. Yep. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. Uh. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? You'd be surprised. Huh. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. Uh, excuse me, I'll just take my leave. Shall we go? Yep. Uh, oh, I know one place actually. They sell all my, they buy all my crap. Looks like we're gonna need to sell it off because I have like literally no money left. Holy, what's going on here? Let's eavesdrop. <laughs> oh wow, these guys are really gonna try to inspect an alley without a search warrant. You no, know that's illegal. All right. I took, I took a course in policing. I know that you can't search anywhere without a warrant. I didn't grad, I didn't finish, but I took the course, and that's just all that matters. I still even have my criminal code. Never gonna use that again, though. Hey, you'll buy this metal. You buy everything I sell you, even all the junk from I get from treasure through the palaces. Uh, it's, well, yeah, it's fake, but it looks real. Hey. And you buy all that crap I bring from palaces. Hmm. 30,000, that's perfect. That's what it was going on for online, so yeah, I'll take it. Yes, we're not broke anymore, ish. Well, most of this is gonna go to the food anyways, so. Uh. Okay. Okay. Shh. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna ask what's inside, but sure. <laughs> Munehisa EY. Yeah, let's go. I don't like the situation going on here. <laughs> D 
They can't search you. They don't have a warrant. <laughs> oh, wow. They're going to search and they don't have anything to prove. You guys are some bad detectives. Oh, shit. This is what eavesdropping does to you. What? Yeah, I'm just... Oh, that's true. That's not a good look at all. Uh, I'm sorry, but I... That's none of your business. <laughs> and if I don't... See ya. Yeah. Wow, that was something. Almost got harassed by a cop. Mm. Who knows? Uh, sure. I mean, it can't hurt to look. Okay. Hey, wait! Would it really matter how real it looks? I mean, it'd work regardless, right? Now's our chance. Would it make the gun powerful? Sure, well, we should go another day. Oh, it's from On. Hi, how are you? Yup. We all saw it. Hmm. <laughs> How are you feeling, though? Ah, uh, that's natural. I'm sure we did. <sighs> I didn't think we'd be able to do it either. Sort of. Don't worry, I won't. I got Morgana for that. He's like my personal alarm clock. Yup. It's all good. I think we're gonna be eating. Uh, um, I like I like barbecue. <laughs> Welp, time to feast. As we do as fan. Okay. Oh, well, not yet. I thought we were going to bed right now. We can't go out right now because. Morgana won't let us. See? Hey. See, Morgana won't let us go do stuff, so all you can do now is go to bed. And you can't quick travel out, so you can't do anything. Wait, how's our plant doing? Okay, it's still healthy. Let's we'll just go to bed then. Sleep. She just wanna close her eyes this way With you, with you, with you mm. <laughs> So good No wonder Lady An chose this place Yeah, this place looks nice Of course it's good This is a famous hotel after all Oh, so it's a hotel buffet Damn, man, none of the hotels I've been through had buffets this nice I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. 
They're probably gonna come to us. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? Uh, wait, somebody made a website about us? Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Oh, looks like we got a little fan. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. Yeah. Mm. Hey, what do we do now? Huh? I mean, you plan on eating? Well, of course I'm gonna eat, but <gasps> this place has a time limit. Oh. Oh crap! We only got an hour to eat. Oh, so it's that type of hotel. Just 50 minutes left. Oh, oh, jeez. Guys are freaking out. We have like 50 minutes left. Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace. Oh. I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu. Wow, these guys are gluttons. Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys too. Don't worry. Oh man, God melts in my mouth. Seriously, only meat? Hey, meat is great. Now where should I start? And she's all about the cake. Hey, cake is good, I guess. Although, a lot of sugar. So happy. <laughs> and, hey. Callie. Yeah, I was just about to say that too. <laughs> Well, that's true. Mm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! The Wilton. Just think about what that's a parody of. And where's our share? Oh yeah, you guys said you are gonna get us something. All I see is meat and cake for you guys. I didn't really know what you'd want, so I just grabbed you some beans. Ugh. Beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there too, so we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. L more beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up, but it should probably still taste good. I don't even know what that is. This is just plain grotesque. Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. I mean, I doubt you know, since you're a cat that believes it's human, but I sure do, so leave it to me. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Mm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. <sighs> That's... That is... You know what, we'll just leave you at that. Oh, this part's cream cheese! They're not even listening. <sighs> wow, you guys are quite a pair. Ons about her sugar and Ryuji's about his meat. Ryuji's just like freaking... Ryuji's like... Oh wow, 8,000 yen per customer. So... With all three of us, well, three and a half if you count Morgana, but he's just some guy that I carry in my bag. That's like 24,000 yen per person. See, what what are we getting first? Alright, let's get some meat. Oh, oh, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Some fish. Let's see. Okay, alright, here's the fish dishes.
How do you say all that and expect me to believe you're human? I think you're more cat now. Oh wait, hold on. Someone's saying something. Hey, what? That's pretty screwed up. Harassment, sexual harassment isn't... Ugh, these women. Oh shit, we all, we've been caught. Um, I paid? Bitch! Who does this bitch think he is? You snobby rich mother. Ah, oh, forget it. Alright, what are we eat? What? Alright, what are we getting now? Okay, we should get some rice next. Okay, where's the rice at? Uh, okay, no, I can't go any further than that. Okay, that's salad. That's fish. Is is okay? I think it's over here. There it is, rice. <sighs> That's just rich people in general. They don't care about anything themselves and they don't really have souls either they're like walking corpses crispy bits well not all rich people are snobs well at least I hope so but the way they like <coughs> Excuse me, got something in my throat. The way they like to portray them, they're all pretty much snobs that don't have souls. Yeah, we're just gonna keep grabbing food and eavesdropping. But yeah, rich people in this day and age just don't have souls or integrity or morals. What? What? <laughs> well, that's one way to describe it. <sighs> you know what? That's a good point. I That's the first thing that adults said that I agree with so far. What? Okay. N now you... Okay, this subordinate... No, that's... Some girl tried to kill herself. And we've been spotted again. No wonder the guilt. What, what was it called? The Wilton Hotel? Yeah, this is a hotel that only rich people stay at. Freaking Paris Hilton's dad. Who, who? So who owns this hotel? What's the name of the socialite that owns this hotel? I'm assuming it's something like Gary Wilton, Ferris Wilton. Well, that's an over-exaggeration. <laughs> it's irony at its- well, I don't know- what did I call it irony? 
What is even here? All I see is like chocolate fountains. <sighs> they call this weird. Yep, looks like it. But look at all this food! And look at all these plates! Oh man, I don't care, I just want to eat. <sighs> oh, look at this guy. You you say that, but you're eat you're munching on all that cake. <sighs> Damn it. Good lord, we're really gonna eat all of this? <laughs> Good lord. Our stomachs must be done. Ah, uh, that that was that was a breeze. That was a breeze. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> Are you kidding? I'll explode if I eat one more thing. Really now? You gonna talk about her parents? Huh? Uh, come on, Ryuji, just ignore them. Adults are adults. Ugh, I'm stuffed. I'm surprised you can fit so much food into that tiny body. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you. <sighs> what floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? What? Yo, what the fuck? What the? There's still no update on the case. Not yet. That guy looks familiar. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it. <sighs> well, look at this guy. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? Um, first of all, you bumped into us. We're in a hurry. That doesn't give you an excuse to push people out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. What the fu- Don't bother with them. What the hell was 
deals with that bossy guy? Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but... That dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. What's wrong? Um, I'm just a bit lightheaded. You're not feeling good? He almost never eats well after all. Plus, I'm always stuck eating canned cat food. <laughs> yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! What took you so long? Uh, I'm sorry? Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. <sighs> they look at all of us like that snobby rich. I wonder if we're out of place here. It always feels like this. Hey Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people. Hmm. Well, yeah, there are a lot of victims. I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? Hmm. But that means we'll have to fight shadows again. Doesn't Oh. Indeed. That can't be avoided. Sorry, I got trigger happy again. Eh. I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? Of course. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world! Are you okay being our leader? Heck yeah! I'm the only one that can lead! No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ann made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. I don't think I'd feel comfortable taking orders from a cat. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I've got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. 
Let me see. How about the diamonds? Uh, no. I'm getting the real Little League Baseball feel from it. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilet? What? We can't use that. Tile, uh, what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Uh, skip. Oh no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. Huh. Yep, time for our team name. Unfortunately, we can't use anything offensive. Just like Pokemon games nowadays. Wait, how do I delete? Okay, circle button. What should we name ourselves? Actually, I got a perfect name, actually. The Doom... Wait, hold on. Can, it, can this fit? I don't think anything that... On my stream, I named this the Doom Squad. But I want to try something else. Doom... Please fit, please fit. I don't think it's gonna fit. It's not gonna fit. Oh wait, never mind. I don't need to type in Doom either. Let's go back, delete all this. We are the Doom. Nah, not patrol. We're not gonna do that. That's what I'll call us. We are the Doom Troop. Yes. Huh. That's not bad at all. Hey, it is great. A good name for a rookie. Shh. We going with that? Yup. Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Like a celebrity? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then. This is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. Oh, mwah, mwah, mwah. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Yep. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they?
Very well. I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. A master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Madarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Now we're not broke anymore, and we got a message. Hmm. Hmm. That's pretty low, but it was better than I expected. Yep, and that is how the Phantom Thieves was started. Anyways, and now we're gonna go search for our next target in the next episode. So once again, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.